What's going on, guys? And welcome back to some more Pokemon Red. In the last part, uh, we basically did the uh, we bid we did the Nugget Bridge section. In this part, and then and then this part, we're gonna do the uh, Route 24 and going into Bills and all that. So uh, I actually did have a failed take of this because I didn't like the how the recording turned out. As simple as that. Now uh, there there's a couple new Pokemon we can find in this team. We can find in this area, and the first of which is uh. First of which is uh, Oddish, only if you're playing Red, and Belfort only if you're playing Blue. However, there's one new Pokemon I want to catch on this team, and there's going to be advice I want to give, but uh, let's see if this is it now. Alright, this is it now. So, um, this is Abra. Now, Abra is really fast, and all it will know will teleport, so you have to kind of find ways around this. However, my advice, and I only learned this during, practice, during the practice playthrough of this, Abra has a really high catch rate, so my advice is just chuck a Pokeball at this thing, and uh, if you fail, just keep trying until you do it, but, uh, because we are not faster than this Abra, and uh, it's going to use Teleport, so, uh, yeah, we're going to have to wait till we find it again. Alright, attempt number two. Now, um, again, we have it at a lower level, so this, pro this should probably be easier to catch, so, uh, Again, we're just going to chuck a Pokeball at this thing. The other thing is it also took uh, two attempts in the failed take, but, uh... Yeah, this actually didn't take as long as it did in the failed take, so I'm actually glad of that. This is not going to be a team member. I'm going to use this for a different purpose later, but we... However, the demand of Abra is that we can teleport to the Pokemon Center. Anyway, so now back on, uh... Now back on Route 24, and now, um... There's a hike we're gonna fight, so um, yeah. So I think I'll in this part, in this successful in this take, I'm only gonna fight the required trainers, and I'll off-screen the remaining ones. But uh, now the hiker wants to fight, and the hiker sent out Machop. Now um, in the failed take, I used Jiggly, try to use Jigglypuff against this Machop. I don't think it was the best idea in hindsight. So I do, however, want to get War Turtle up one more level because he's gonna learn a new attack. It's gonna be more helpful on the on the next gym leader because. I don't have anything that can take out water types. So, uh, yeah, so, uh... Let's try to use Bubble because of the time for weakness. Which it took him out, so, uh... Yeah, it's like you can literally just pour water on a Geodude with a fucking faint. And let's fight uh, another Hiker. You're going to see Bill first, let's fight. Anyway, so, um... Anyway, so Hiker wants to fight, and this uh, this Hiker's only gonna have an it's gonna have a level 17 Onyx, but Onyx has really bad special defense, so we're just gonna throw it on a bubble and it'll probably take it out. We should be almost at uh, level 24. This trainer I wanna keep alive for purposes we will be doing later. Now I tried doing this particular thing in the failed take, and uh, let's just say we're not going to try that a second time. I'll get to this later, but, uh... Anyway, last wants to fight, and last sent out Nidoran. Now, we should be almost at level 24. Our defense fell, so, um... Uh, unfortunately, the problem, I guess the big problem with choosing Squirtle to start is you do get a decent water type, but the problem with Squirtle is that there are other water types in the game that can do the job better, so, uh, like, you get easy, you get, you get, you get advanced in some of the gym leaders, but you also get, like, uh, you get, like, uh, you, your problem is you can get water types to do By the way, at level 24, and also, we're trying to learn Bite. Now, the interesting thing is, uh, Bite in Generation 1 is a normal type move, but, uh, it's still gonna be really helpful because of the stronger move than Tackle, so, uh... Especially since we don't have anything that will take out water types. Anyway, so, uh, Hiker wants to fight. These two, this is before these trainers have any names, so we're just gonna, um... Now, since we have an Abra, we can just flat out make it to Bill and just teleport back to the Pokemon Center. This will probably be a shorter part, and uh, I really apologize if this is, but, um... 
Mount, probably not as short as, uh, definitely short compared to the Mount Moon part, but, uh, hell, I don't even get to level 25, but, um, I'm using just Bubble for the rock types and, like, watering up for any other move. I haven't really tried Bite yet, but, uh, again, Bite's not a dark type move, so Mach Machop isn't going to be resistant to it. I decided not to use Abra on my team mainly because Abra is one of those uh, Pokemon you can only get through trading to fully evolve through trading, and I ruled them against using those types of Pokemon. So, if you can trade with another version and get an Alakazam, it is one of the best Pokemon in the game. However, um, I have other ideas for taking out Poison types, though, and I have other ideas for taking out Fighting types. So it's uh, now yeah, I want to get I want to get that one right because in the failed take, I actually fucked that up on getting that, uh, because you want it, you want him to walk certain distance, otherwise you have to go back later and get that, uh, TM. Image your trainer sent out Radida. We are 10 levels ahead of this, but I think in the failed take, however, we did not take, take out this Radida in one hit. But we do now, so, uh... And it's Ekans, uh... The other thing I forgot to point out is that Ekans is snake spelled backwards, and it's of all form, Arbok is also Cobra spell backwards. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, that was weird. I just heard kind of like a slowed down, like weird version of the Trainer Battle theme. I don't think I've ever encountered that, but uh. My friend has a cute Pokemon. I'm so jealous. Anyway, so it's gonna have an Oddish. So let's 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 see, let's see if like Bite can take it out. And it, it flinched. So it has a 10% chance of flinching. So that's great. However, um, level 25. So uh, I'm just gonna. Uh, actually, uh, let's just, uh, take out our, keep our war turtle out. We are very over-leveled for this part of the game, so uh, we only have two team members, though, but, uh, let's see if level 25 is enough to, uh, one-shot this Oddish. I'm not so jealous. Anyway, so, um, yeah, so, uh, let's just say, uh, if we go in here, now, if you're playing the yellow version, your Pikachu is going to have a reaction to this Pokemon. Hi, oh, yeah, I'm a Pokemon. No, I'm not. Call me Bill. I'm a true Pokemon blue po Pokemaniac. Hey, what's with that skeptical look? I'm not joshing you, so I threw up an experiment and got combined with, uh, Pokemon. How about it? Come out here. I'm very illiterate because I was joking, but, uh, Bear initiate teleporters, uh, self scepter, and now, um, that's gonna make him, uh, human. You can skip, there's a way you can skip this area, but I will elaborate more on that later. Yeah, you, you mainly have to do this, but you can get away, there's a way you can get around skipping this, but I'll get to that point much later, but, uh, he's gonna give us an SS ticket, but, uh, which gets us to the SSN in Vermilion City. You can, there is a way you can skip the SSN, but I will elaborate more on that later. So, uh, we're going to teleport back to the last Pokemon Center because that's the, our advantage having Abra. And I think I'm going to cut it off to this part of Pokemon Red. So next time Pokemon Red, we're going to tackle the uh, Cerulean City Gym. So see you guys then.